Should be okay. All right. Uh, uh, it's a little cold out tonight. As it is many of the nights here. You think I'd live in Sapporo with how many? Might I just say how cold it is, but uh, I don't. There's a little tidbit for everybody out there. I do not live in Sapporo. Hi, everyone. All right, so tonight I thought about what I wanted to stream, and I wanted to stream a bit of Persona 5 because some people said that hey, they'd like to see some Persona 5. Uh, D-Generation Cross Wars kind of burned out a little bit on it, so taking an extended vacation from it. But uh, Persona 5 Strikers, uh, the demo was released for the Nintendo Switch and the PS4 recently. And it is a free demo if you um, have either a Switch or a PlayStation 4 with a Japanese account, you can download it. I picked uh, playing this on the Switch mainly because I was uh, curious... Like, I like the idea of being able to take this essentially anywhere, and Persona 5 isn't exactly known for being the most graphically demanding game. So I was very curious about how well this holds up. I haven't tried played too much of it, so uh, let's just get into it, shall we? Bad account. Ugh. End of a long week. I need so much of a break. Just pop out my chat. It's life so much easier. There we go. Oh, hi, Brave Exius. What are you doing there? There we go. We don't need that yet. Is my camera... No, it's just... There we go. Should be... Easy centered. So yes, this is the demo. Let's, uh, let's just check it out. Let's, uh, not talk too much about it. Looks all fine. I'm actually more interested in this than Persona 5 The Royal, uh, mainly because this is, like, actual new stuff, whereas Persona 5 The Royal is mostly the old stuff. Not that Persona 5 wasn't good, but it's kind of more interesting to have something that's, like, completely new. Hey, Shibuya, I've been there. Also, I don't remember if my camera's in a good spot. What a badass! Also, I do not know if there are streaming rules about this game, but I would assume uh, mostly no. But it is an Atlas game, and Atlas is paranoid about this kind of stuff, so. Also, kind of want to show off just how actually kind of pretty good this is on the Switch. Oh, uh, Navi. Or Oracle. Uh, let's... I already kind of have played a little bit of this, so I do know... Uh, 
Oh, easy. Rude. So yeah, this is, for anybody who hasn't heard about this game, this game is a Muso, which is basically one of the um, style of Dynasty Warriors, fighting large amounts of enemies, being really overpowered, uh, killing tons of guys. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to use something right here, but I don't want it quite yet, because this is actually pretty fun. Bad horsey. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, it's a little... It's actually kind of a nice little mix. I was worried that it was going to be very much just um, all Muso, but there's actually quite a bit of Persona still in this. Gotta love the drones. So you can get an idea for just slashing through tons of stuff, but uh, let's do the thing we're supposed to do. Blinding, bleh, blinding bright light. Never a big fox fan. Hello, Makoto. Haru. And of course, Fubada. Yay. Oh man, the music's so good. But if I do, if I don't talk enough, they uh, block stuff on YouTube. Actually, they still will block stuff. But anyway. character. I don't know. I, I've heard that there are some people that said that they missing some of the style. I think there's a good amount of style still in this game. Chatting, chatting, chatting! My seat's too far back. Uh, if I sit that far back, I'm gonna fall asleep. One thing I gotta say is I wish there was a auto advance for the story. That is just such a nice thing to have nowadays. There's the speed through, which is hold X, and there's log, which is Y, but... Unless it's a button I haven't figured out yet. Hold on. No. Oh,しかし、ゲームの中に突如表現し、公文書の改ざんを告白しました。No, she's gonna be a bad guy. 
次に札幌中央市議会議員3名本会議中に自ら汚職を告白して辞職次有名小説家の S 氏突然の断筆会見を開き芥山賞を辞退自らの作品を打作だと号泣発表出版を拒否続いて民放の看板キャスター生放送中に出演者に愛を告白振られるそして最後警察庁刑事局長が突如全裸になり省内を走り回って逮捕<笑>何かおかしいかね長谷川警部補いやすみません<笑>これらの多くは一部を除いて単なる珍事件として扱われていますがいずれの事件も人格の急激な表現が認められます先に挙げた対象者は全て表現する前までは精神に異常などは認められていませんつまり外的な要因がなければ考えづらい精神錯乱による異常行動です精神錯乱ただの偶然じゃないのか誰かが人の心を操作してるとでも先ほどの事件はあくまで一例で全国的に類似事件が多発している状況です心の回答だ。静粛に進行を続けたまえありがとうございます冠城管理官先ほどご意見が出たように当該事件は半年前まで世間を騒がせていた事件心の怪盗団による改心事件の疑いがあると上層部は判断しておりますの<笑>し,しかし脈絡がなさすぎるんじゃないか無差別にやってるようにも思える動機も推測できんだろうまるで愉快犯だ以上の件を諸君に調べてもらいたいなるだけ早くな私が諸君に求めることは二つ一つは本件を立件するのに十分な証拠を抑えること二つ目はそれを短期間で行うことなぜかわからんが上はこの件にご出身だ我々は結果を出さねばなる容疑者は怪盗団のリーダー改めてこの男を、えー、We're still famous I mean not the good kind infamous maybe but whatever The day schedule returns. I'll line my camera. I need to buy a camera Viagra. Mona! Yay! I want a kitty like Mona. We're on the government radar, basically. Which was kind of the thing. Man, this music puts, makes me feel right back at home. I wish that every time I walked in my house, I heard this music. Nah, nah. 
Hey, good, but no, that's a stupid joke. It's interesting is there's actually a lot of the um, tobacco store. Don't smoke, kids. Nah. Mona is a bully in this game. Much as the same way as uh, Mona was in original Persona 5. Yeah. Bully. But he will let me buy from the vending machine. But yeah, the uh, areas look very similar to like original Persona 5. I've heard that the uh, shadows look better on the PS4 too. The load times are better on the PS4, but it's not really a big deal. It's kind of weird that they cut this area off. Like, they definitely didn't redesign these areas, I think, from scratch for this game, but... And again, I guess this game did kind of have a long development time. Aw, nobody's here for us. Guess we're not special. Hey! Yeah. Oh, I Makoto wearing that jacket, man. He told you, Roto! Ah! The this this I don't get from Persona 5: The Royal. It's nice to be back with everybody in Persona 5: The Royal. It doesn't feel quite as good as being like continuing and being like, "Oh, we're back together again. Everyone's back together." Except someone. <laughs> Oh, uh, it warms my cold, dead little heart. そろそろ店開けるからよ。続き、お前の部屋だ。よし。好きに使え。あいよ。その代わり、後で店手伝えよ。よし。じゃあ全員アジトに集合。That's such a cute little outfit she's got. <laughs> oh, it's hard not to geek out on this. I do believe the loading times are like approximately 40, 40, 50 percent longer in PS4. まったく。相変わらずね。少しは真面目に授業を受けたら。お、生徒会長の鉄拳制裁来る。それいい加減忘れて。大学ってやつは楽しいのか。え、充実してるわ。今のうちに基礎を固めないと。Hmm? is gonna be like the greatest vegetable grower in the universe. Oh. 
そうなんだけど興味があれば他の学部の授業も受けられるようになってるの農学の授業があってね収穫量と土壌の栄養素の関係とかうんけ我が輩すぐ寝ちまいそうだ双葉は学校はどう思うふんふん余裕だ満員電車と体育以外はだいぶ慣れたぞ褒めてくれていいぞで、肝心のお前は地元でうまくやれてんのかよかったあなたはどこでもうまくやれそうだものねまあ俺もそれなりにはやってんだけどさやっぱお前がいねえとピリッとしねえっつうかそりゃとう私たちのリーダーだからなだねっ怪盗団魂は永遠ってやつなフェントムフィーブスバックトゥギャラビールスティールはどう過ごすの今日予定を決めるのよねそうそうそれ決めなきゃ夏休みの間はずっとこっちにいられるんだよねやっぱ旅行じゃね一ヶ月遊び放題なわけじゃんあのね宿題の存在とか忘れてないうそれにみんなは高三でしょ卒業とか進路のことだって言わないで分かってるから今だけは忘れさせて相変わらずだな、リュウジは。話を戻すが、旅行なら京都がいい。自社仏閣を回り、ひたすらスケッチに勤しむ。一月あれば、どれだけの芸術に出会えるか。歴史と伝統ある文化財が、俺を呼んでいる。芸術系なら、私はパス。あんま興味ない。It's a little weird the border on the top and bottom of the screen, though. Hmm? Summer plans. The summer break is like only like a month here in Japan, I think I've heard. Really want there just to be an auto button. Oh, good. An automated PC thing. That can't be evil. That's the, that's the killer. I found it. All right, I figured it out already. The AI is the killer. Yep, that's the killer. That's the main boss. That shall be the thing that fucks fucketh everything up. It. 
Ja. テレビでも特集されてたわねすごく優秀だから急速に普及したってそうそうなかなかよくできてる龍二の1万倍は賢いうっせえでもまあちょっと興味あったんだよなうまいラーメン屋とか教えてくれそうじゃんよかったらみんな入れてみろいろいろ便利だぞもしかしたら遊びに出かけた先で困った時使えるかもしれないわね Yeah, he's gonna take over everybody. It's gonna be Skynet. We're all screwed. And unfortunately, my favorite character is the one who made it. Hello, my name is Siri. Enter my name. Oh, not on screen. Not this again. Um, I hate the Japanese system, though. It is, it's meant to be like using kanji, but I don't like kanji. So I guess I'm gonna be Ray for the rest of time. That's fine. I'm not really wanting to play a Muso game on hard. No, there we go. Uh huh. Not your friend. Not your friend. Also, Japan is not the land of Wi-Fi, where I assume that there's a Wi-Fi router in this place. That should have been a mini-game. You just moved back in. Your relatives have changed the Wi-Fi router and therefore the password. Find the password because they forgot to tell you. I don't need Westworld in my persona. No, not Sugewa. Although I do kind of want to see evil cool Haru. That would be evil AI Haru. ずっとも明日でよくね。外くそ暑いし。移動でこいつも疲れてんだろう。せっかく集まったんだし、今日は久しぶりの味とでダブろうぜ。あ、話したいことはいくらでもある。特に近代芸術におけるもんだいてんと
All right, here we go. Time for Mona Bully. I, I'm doing it mainly for the sound effects. My plant! I want that as my ringtone. Just like old times. Mona not letting me do jack shit that I probably could be doing to be more efficient. Mona, I'm not tired. Trust me, I know more than you. No, it shall not be fun. But it's a Persona game, and of course, whenever we sleep, we go to Night World. Well, Velvet Moon. Whatever. Ooh. Well, nice to know you guys haven't improved this place at all. I was rehabilitated! Why am I doing this again? Hi, Nina. How are you? That music. Uh, wait, where's... where's dude? Oh, by the way, this video contains spoilers for Persona 5. Tired, very tired, and this weekend is gonna be... Hell weekend, kind of. But I'm glad you're doing good. I ordered a pizza, two pizzas tonight, and I ate one of them, and I put the other one away. But I'm still hungry. Also, this counts as Japanese practice, by the way. I'm also very curious about, like, I haven't watched any of the 10 billion live streams they've done for this game. Like, they have done, Atlas has done an, uh, an annoying amount of live streams showing off a lot of this game. So I'm not entirely sure how it works, but I'm very curious because these Dynasty Warrior games usually end up being quite grindy. Nice hairband. Also, I'm very curious how they do the DLC in this game. I noticed that the new Persona 5 Royal Girl is not in it. I wonder why. それでこそ私のシルトリックスターです。この先にはあの時と同じ家でそれ以上の苦難が待ち受けていることでしょう。ですが私はいつもあなたのそばにいます。それ時間のようですね。いずれまたお会いしましょう。I also look forward to taking way too long to get to the characters I really want to play. 
I really want to cut stuff up with Haru. I really want to beat shit up with Makoto. But uh, this is about as close as you're going to get to Persona 5 on the Switch, I think. Oh. I don't really understand how the new raid works. Uh, the, what do you not understand, Nina? The The way I understand it is... Oh, shit. Guild War is on. I'm starting to forget about Guild Wars. Um... The way it works is you keep doing missions and eventually the raid pops up and then you go in and you play the raid. Never played this game? That's too bad. It's really good. Why is there a deal or why is there a download? So like you keep doing like anything that costs regular stamina and like as you beat it more it gets more difficult and as it gets more difficult uh the rewards it pays out are generally better you're just it's a currency grind you grind the currency to spend the currency to get items Shit. been 30 minutes and we really haven't done much in this game yet Yay! Yay! Look at how cute! I love her jacket! Look at that jacket! That is cool, man. I want that jacket, actually. I, I, I like the green jacket. That's nice. What I'm trying to say is I want it. I want it. So yeah, you just keep uh, grinding regular stuff and every once in a while a raid will pop up. You can do it on auto too, so it seems to be that it takes a hundred stamina max to get one. Which is an improvement from the 300 stamina it used to take, but if you're asking if the raid is really that improved, not really. Join multiplays room. You can do that, too. Who am I supposed to fight? Ah, oh, let's just fight you. Pretty sure I can kill a level 50 Ayaka. First goal, buy barbecue set. Go to Yodebashi camera. For all your camping needs, go to Yodabashi Camper Camera. It literally has everything. えっと、エマ。はい、お呼びですか。ああ、あれだあれ。昨日言ってた店に案内してくれ。目的地までのガイドを開始します。おお。地図出たぜ。そんな聞き方でわかんのかよ。<笑> Whoa, 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 Emma, 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 we're going to have to have a little bit of a talk about what is appropriate in terms of you listening to me when I am not wanting you to. That is not cool. She was listening to what we had to say, but we didn't say her name. It is not cool. So she's some kind of pop star. Yippee ki yay. 
I do sometimes tap through a little too fast. I do like the fact that I can actually say that I've been there now, where it's like, oh yeah, Shibuya, I've been there, that's cool. That looks exactly like Shibuya. Like, I played through Persona 5 and then I went to Shibuya and it was just like, wow, this is like, so, uh, can I run into the Phantom Thieves, please? We got six UR orbs from Story. Make sure you don't spend them all in one place now. I know you're excited, but uh, new characters might come at any time. Oh yeah, I also got a milkshake tonight with my pizza. It's a cheesecake milkshake. It's okay. How many hours did it take to set up your hair? Also, I, I, I didn't want to say her name's like Alice, which is obviously a thing of Alice, because it's like Alice in Wonderland, Mad Hatter, Tea Ceremony. Fuck it. Am I going to get DCMA by Atlas and Disney? Great, more paper waste. Cool, I'll make sure to keep it forever. No, Nina, there's actually no new unit that we are aware of. Uh, there is the, uh, there is the, uh, banner, which has the two new vision cards on it. But that's it. It also has Keton and Yerma uprates, but, uh, surprisingly no Valentine unit. I'm actually really, really surprised. I mean, kind of disappointed. I was hoping for a new powerful AoE unit, and uh, we got jack shit. I I'm not even sure what the cards do. Excuse me for a second, I need to check something. Uh, Fumitsu. I do love how the, the boss for the raid just looks like a giant chocolate turd. Luck up. 15% up to 35%. Luck? Ugh. And also Earth Attribute attack up by a certain percentage. So good if you have Keton and Mont. Uh, the other one, which is the SR card, 
Soil Attribute Killer up, Dexterity down, and Defense Weakness up. Okay. I love that the UR card is basically Keton saying how much he absolutely loves Mont, and Mont's just oblivious, which means that Keton got crushed on Valentine's Day. And the other card is literally like a whole bunch of girls dreaming about... Uh, uh, stern or whatever it is and it's just like they're not gonna get anything either well I think that Valentine's Day is actually very properly depicted in War of the Visions sad and depressing we did get Tetra Nina Tetra Sylphid I mean the summon summon edition has been pretty good it's faster than I thought the summons would be Remember, Singles Awareness Day is one week away. Uh, it's, it's fucking sad. Yeah. Yeah, I know, I chased Odin too much. Thirty K, Nina. Big dreams. エマの友達キーワードキノフタバが使ってたキノじゃないか友達になれるってやつだおいいじゃんやってみろよキーワードを入力すればアリスと友達になれるっていうことか I love how they give you the little taste of gameplay at the start, otherwise this would have been 30 minutes of doing literally nothing. <laughs> And we get taken to the other world. Nice circle patterns. Waiting. 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 Eh. Eh. I mean, if I wanted faster, I would do it on the PS4. It's a Persona game. Of course we end up in the other freaking world. Well, that seems like bad news. Okay, we're just stealing hearts now, literally. Hey, wait a second, that's our job! Alright, finally, gameplay. By the way, the remix, so good.
get some nice little combo he's going. I love the, the how they incorporated a lot of the different elements from More enemies! Alright, this is the thing I haven't quite figured out yet. But this is pretty cool. You gotta, like, look up, press the A button, which allows you to move up here. And then you press the X button, and you get to do, like, a little flow motion. Got him. Oh wait, there's still a few more. I still like the drones. The drones are cute. I don't know if we have actually... Run away! Oh shoot, they're invincible. Run away! Like, I'm curious about how the uh, leveling up upgrading works in this game. Persona, uh, or like the other Musou games, it's very much collecting items and then using those items to power up characters. Oh shoot, my battery phone battery is at thirty percent. Yabeko 
やるしかねえな。Damn Makoto, I want to use Makoto in her special bike. Wow, we are really bad thieves. We are really bad thieves! Ow! Boss. So she's so her real life version's Alice, but her over the her the other world version is the Red Queen. Okay, I'm very interested if they keep going with this theme of fairy tales. I mean, she might be the Cheshire Cat, but I'm pretty sure, given the cane, that she's supposed to be the Red Queen or Pink Queen, whatever. That outfit, though. Holy cow, I'm really glad that I have my YouTube channel set that it's not for kids. Ow! Well, that went well. Well, at least we landed on something soft. I mean, not Ryuji. Ryuji landed on the ground, but we landed on something soft. いきなり分殴られてたけど大丈夫か、ジョーカー。大丈夫。ならいいけどよ。あの野郎調子に乗りやがって。さっさと戻って一発かましてやんねえと、俺の気が済まねえ。で、どこなんだよ、ここは。地
These menus are so cool. Those menus are badass, man. <laughs> With Anne. Okay. Oh, can I just say that whoever the team is, like, the Persona team that made Persona 5, man, and do all this cool visual styles, this is great. I love this. I am so buying this game on launch day. What the hell is that? It's a Borg! The Borg are here! Oh god, we Persona 3 now! Girlfriend! Girlfriend! Turn into girlfriend! It worked! Holy shit, man. I was joking, but there you go. See, it's just that easy to find a relationship. All you need to do is find your mystery cube and touch it and wish really hard. Nice to meet you, Sophia. <laughs> no, really, this is taking a big page, it feels like, from Persona 3. Aegis versus Sophia, both robotic. Wait, did, did she just say that it was a ta tanuki? <laughs> and then Mona's like, I'm a cat. Wait, I'm not a cat. Look, I found a magic cube, okay? You know, sometimes you go into a magical world, get caught by an evil idol who thinks that she's God, then throws you into a garbage pit and you find yourself a digital girlfriend. I don't know what's so weird about any of this. I think the I, I think I figured it out. I know why there's no like you have a relationship with X, Y, and or Z character in this game anymore. It's because everyone has amnesia, just momentary or like temporary amnesia. Oh, it's no money. Come on, Terra, now, Yakuni Tatsuo. 
私は人の良き友人人の役に立つために生まれた助けてくれるってのかよそうだどんな状況だいやなんか迷ってるっつか出口地下から出られればいいのかああ,あひとまずそうだがオーケー任せ出口を探してくるお,おい一人で行くなどうするジョーカーそうだが脱出の手がかりになるかもしれない大丈夫かよ怪しさ全開すぎんだろまあ放置ってわけにもいかねえかおい待てシャドウに見つからねえように気ぃつけろよでも見つかってるし離れろソフィアこいつらどっから湧き上がった Oh my god Is it like RNG Muso encounters? <laughs> It is RNG Muso encounters? What? How does that work? Okay, we're gonna play up the idea that she's not gonna become a battle robot. Okay! Actually, her and Fubi are going to be bestie friends forever. One's a computer girl, one's a girl made out of computers. You're the first thing you saw, or she saw, so you've imprinted on her. Introducing of stealth mechanics. Jeez. Yep. Uh, she'll be fine. Oh, 
めたし何者だ怪盗団を助けると約束した<笑>とにかく我が配達を戦うぞあ、uh, she's doing more damage than I have Oh, I love the remixes, man. <laughs> She's adorable. Told you, battle robot. Interesting. Hey, items. Wait, what? Joseph, there's a thing here. Shadow, I name it. You go there. Boy, Takarabo, can I open it? Hey, stuff. That's cool, man. Probably couldn't have done that anyway because there was going to be a cutscene to introduce. But... Do I climb up? I want up! Oh, right. I can jump now. Holy shit. That is actually kind of huge. I'm just like. Why can't I just run automatically run up there? Because they gave me a fucking jump button. It's like if you have a jump button in Legend of Zelda. You just don't know that you can use it. Because you're not used to having it. Money, money.
what even is Scramble Demo? So Scramble is the new game that's coming out on the 20th, but they've released the demo for this. That's pretty actually seamless. Cool. Level. And he got heal. That's going to be useful. So this is Persona 5 Scramble. This is a sequel slash follow-up to the game Persona 5 or Persona 5 The Royal. Although I'm not entirely sure which one, since this one doesn't seem to uh, acknowledge Kasumi's existence. It's not DLC, it's a full game. See? It's a full game. It's basically built on the style of the Musou games, but to exactly what extent, I'm still not entirely sure. It is not a piece of DLC for Persona 5, it is its own game. With its own story and its own new characters as well. So yeah, this is much more action-based than... Ow! I am very curious. That's cool. Feel more than welcome to ask. I've played quite a bit of Persona, so... So the original Persona games are turn-based RPGs, and this is, well, just not that. So it, it runs, like, from what I can tell, it runs a lot on the Persona 5 engine, because a lot of the graphics, the visual styles, the, like, the way the environments look, they seem very similar. But it's using, but it's using the uh, Muso engine. Got it. I got it. You're already making me jump earlier. So, like the original, each Persona game, each numbered Persona game is its own story with its own characters, but it does kind of exist in the same universe. So, as far as I know, that one I'm not entirely 100% sure about. But the Persona games. Like Persona 1, Persona 2, Persona 3, Persona 4, and Persona 5 take place in the same world, but they are like separate as far as I can tell. Like you find like uh, hints of characters from other games in the world. So yeah, it's basically just takes place in Japan. Usually involves high school students and going to this kind of secret world, but every Persona has its own like themes and whatnot. So Persona 5 was very based on like thieves and whatnot. <clears throat> but uh, Persona 5 was the uh, turn-based game, and now this is a little bit more action-packed. Alright. Stealth tutorial? I feel like this will be the stealth tutorial. The one thing I will say is that it, the themes don't exactly mesh together. The idea behind the original Persona 5 was like, you know, a lot of stealth can give you advantages and being clever. But the Musou games don't exactly lend themselves to that line of thinking. Most of the time it's, I SMASH THINGS WITH A HAMMER! So the uh, Persona, one of the things I was, I really love about Persona, it was like a classic term based RPG with a lot of swag to it. Like the movement systems were really, really cool. Like for instance, right here. So like you can see right there. We also have, uh... 
guns uh, too. But yeah, every uh, one of the Persona 5 characters kind of has their own themes and whatnot. That's her persona? What the f Oh, she gets heal. Oh my god! Yes. Love it. She, I, I want to call her Emoji Girl. Welcome to the Alice's... Welcome to the Alice's Wonderland. Uh, is that just bad English? Whoops. Whoops. Say. It's, it's very, like, animated. It's supposed to be very movement-y. Like, it's, it's very, I guess, anime. But it's meant to be super stylish. Oh shit, why'd you put me down there? Ugh. But as you can see, we can do, like, some really cool moves. Like, there is some really cool stuff you can do here. I like the idea of just cutting it and, like, making it fall to the ground. That's really clever, fun way to, like, interact with your environment. Ooh, status effects. Ooh, I got status effect. Oh, I'm slower to move. Like, they really want you to have the flow, like, the feeling of movement and whatnot. Nice. <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna get tired of, the, of her, uh, face dies. Not to mention the music is just always good in Persona games. So, like, currently we're just kind of learning a lot about how to play the game and all the things. Like, the first level is very tutorial -y, Which is, you know, normal for a video. Damn video games. Oh, yeah, I say, it's like, I'm loving this. This is fantastic. It actually runs way better on the Switch than I thought it would. I know some people are going to be... I think on the PS4 it runs at 60 frames per second, and on the Switch it runs 30 frames per second, but uh, that's never bothered me, so I don't really care. So yeah, you also take advantage of your... Ooh, this is an actual boss. Oh, lock on would have been nice earlier. Oh wow, that kick. So that's how they were like I was curious how they handle a boss because And here's the big beat up. Master Arts. So yeah, like enemies have their own weaknesses and whatnot. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I'm gonna be playing this game a lot. The problem with a lot of the Muso games is they get very rep they feel very repetitive very quickly. This feels like a really nice mix between Persona 5 and um, this. That vent, I know that vent is interactable eventually. Not right now. They won't let me yet, but I know that vent is interactable. Simply interactable! Anyway, this game, uh, like the demo allows you to play through the opening part of the game, and then it will allow you to carry your save file over to. Uh, the full game that comes out in about a week, two weeks, roughly two weeks. Thing I've always loved about Persona 5 is just how overly stylized it is. No other game looks as looks quite like this. The menus, the design, the polish. People complain a lot. Hey, Atlas games are expensive. Yeah, but they're nice. They're really nice. A lot of the times there's some really good polish here. Like Square Enix stuff is shiny. Square Enix stuff is like really shiny nowadays. It's so like it's beautiful, but it's in, it's beautiful in the sense of like a rare coin or something like that, where you just know that there's been a lot of work put into it, and that's really good. However, uh, Persona Five is like just something you don't see that often. You know, it's hard to find a distinct visual style a lot of the days, and I think that really does a good job. Yeah. Wait, can she come out into the real world? ジョーカー。話が分かるな。まあ、ソフィアの話を信じるしかないか。あ。お前は一緒に来ないのかよ。私はどうしたらいい? ジョーカーの言う通りだ、ソフィア。桜中シャドウだらけだろ。一人でうろつくのは危険だぜ。どうぞ。たくしょうがねえな。Look, she's basically the Gundam girlfriend. Just put, just keep her in the party. Although she'll probably turn into a final boss. Somehow. Oh, we're taking her into the real world. This will be interesting. The trees! Two weeks! So yeah, that's the demo. 
It's stylish, it's sexy, it sets up everything I wanted to know about the game. Uh, it gives me a look into how the game plays, feels great, plays great, absolutely love it. Really do. I think that it is everything I could have wanted. Actually, it's better than I thought it would end up. I thought it was going to be like a lot of other uh, warrior games where it's just go into the stage and fight stuff. All right, so let me just get some stuff open first. Also, it wasn't like a super long demo. I was kind of wondering if it would be like incredibly long or not. It's not bad. It's just the right amount. It gives me a bit of a taste. I'm ready for the game to come out though. Or I can switch over, I gotta... Oh, is this the opening video? Yeah, this video is pretty cool. I don't think this is the one that plays earlier. Oh, it is. I just need to update before I switch over. If it's worth getting blocked once on YouTube, it's worth getting blocked twice. Yeah. All right, I'm just going to turn this off and uh, reset the stream under different category. Uh, where is it? It's still not what I want. Because, yeah, I was wanting to do that, but I knew it wasn't going to take the entire night. So I'm just going to reset the stream and I'll be right back.